I know that I'm example. I know 100% in the pitch and outside the pitch. So I'm always smile. I'm happy, man. I'm blessed that I play in a fantastic club. I have a fantastic family. I have four kids. I'm healthy. You're probably the most famous footballer in the world. What's that like? What's it like being a footballing superstar? It's great. Uh, this has given me motivation to, to still work hard and better in my job. But I have to say, uh, to be in my shoes is not easy. You have to work. I try to do it almost every day. This is why I'm in the top level many, many years. I think it's not, it's not by coincidence. It's uh, because I do it extra outside the pit. When I'm 12 years old, most of the people told me, Cristiano, you are a very, very good talent player, but you are very skinny, very slim. And I put it in my mind, the body we can improve. We can improve, you go to gym, dedication and hard work, you can improve. So I have improved myself. Athleticism means a lot. For me, I think the small details uh, in the end are going to make a huge difference to compare with the, with the other players. So I think it's very important to do this kind of work. And I think it's going well on me. This is why I'm in good shape almost all the year. And I want to carry on like that because it's, it's helped me a lot. It's part of me. I'm not doing that kind of work because I have to. It's because it's part of me. This is very important for me. I'm always a competitive uh, player. Uh, not just in the games, I'm in the training, I'm like that. In the home, with my sisters, with my mom, with uh, my nephews, I'm always uh, try to competitive hard and try to win. Uh, I'm like that. You know, I'm not, I'm not, I never change. Uh, because I like, I like this, I like what I do, I like my life, I'm a happy person. So, competitive is part of, of my life, so. In Madeira, in Madrid, in uh, England, I always want to win, I always competitive person, so it's part of me. Everyone in my family loves football. Well, I remember I always play in, uh, in the street. One day my father uh, came uh, and he said to me, why you don't come in for the club when I, when I work? I said, yes, why not? And I start to play, you know, to have the same routine. And I start, I go to every day to training and I like it to be part of, you know, a team. And uh, I training every day and, you know, my father was there to help me. Well, in the beginning, I feel that I, I was different than the other kids. Yes, I feel. But I didn't even thinking that one day I would be professional. Playing, for example, in Manchester United or Real Madrid or even in sporting. I just play, you know, to enjoy, but I, I never think that hey, I have talent and I'm going to be professional. In the beginning, I didn't feel that. First thing and the most important thing for me is it's football, of course. Nothing above that. But of course, this kind of stuff, I like it too. Uh, so, something that I that I was involved many many years uh, since I was 18. So it's something that I like it. But of course my my, my first focus is of course the football. But fashion is something that I like it too. The people really don't know you. Who is the people to judge something that they don't know? Of course this is it's something that I don't like. But I. I have to live with that. I cannot change. I cannot change my personality. I can, cannot change my character. I cannot change my education. You know, I respect the people, but of course I don't agree because the real people who know me, he knows who is Cristiano. You understand? So I cannot change the mind of the other people. Maybe sometimes in the pitch, I show something that the people don't don't want or don't like. But this is my my kind of way to to thinking because I'm an ambition person. I'm, I don't smile a lot in the pitch because I, I try to be focused. But in this, in one point, I really understand some people because, you know, in a life we have always the people who judge us. But I think sometimes this is not fair, but you know, we have to live with that. 
Why make the move from Manchester United to Real Madrid when you did? I think everything of a, a beginning and end and everything. So what I, I do, uh, what I did in Manchester is completely finished because I win almost everything there. So I always try for a new challenge. Uh, this is what I try to do, to move from Manchester from Madrid. It's not about the, the contract, uh, it's about new challenge, my family too, close to my family, different weather, the language. Everything and most the most important things what I move is a challenge because I'm, I really like to put myself in the pressure to see what I can 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 do. And um, follow his dreams, work hard. Many many important people and people who I respect a lot, especially my my dad and my mom, always give me you should you should respect. If you want respect, you should respect other people. And this is what I always put in my mind. If you see my, my career at the, the last six, seven years, I, I'm always on kind of similar level. Why? As I said before, it's a long process. It's a dedication, it's hard work. And for the future, I will try to maintain the same. I'm gonna, I'm gonna push myself until my body uh, gives me good answer. So this is why I'm enjoying the present, and uh, I don't think a lot about the future because I know the future will be good too. But I just enjoy the moments. I feel good. My body is good. It's maybe the best moments of my career so far, and I want to continue. Record Maxi. Nothing. Zero. Uh, I just try to do my best every season to win the, the golden boot. It's, it's important for me, it's my, my second one. And uh, it's something that I look forward for that. Uh, I have opportunity now to, to say thank you to my teammates because they, they help me a lot. They give me great passes to score goals. But it's, you know, what I say a few interviews before, I will change the, the own uh, personal things for collective awards like Champions or La Liga because this is the most important but in terms of individual I think I, I play very very good this season and I'm really really happy with the, what I did. Still work hard and better in my job but I have to say, uh, to be in my shoes is not easy. I always want to win, I always competitive person, so it's part of me. I always thinking, when I take that decision, I will be a professional player, I will be something in football. I was cry almost every day to miss my family, but I'm not, I'm not regret because it was probably the more, inten more intense moments in my life that, I, that I, live, I live through. Without sacrifice, we cannot win nothing. So I did an unbelievable sacrifice, my family too. I feel happy. Uh, all this happened because the reason, the reason I'm unbelievable inside the pitch. This is why the people have so much interest on me. Are you the best footballer in the world right now? I think so, yes. The best words is, words is dedication and hard work. To achieve this kind of things, you need to work hard and, you know, be a great professional, be serious in your job. And this is what I try to do, you know, to be here for eight time, I think it's not by coincidence. It's it's because you know we all have talent, but talent without the work, it's nothing. The level that I am is like uh, in other sports, Formula One, uh, NBA. The best players always follow the best players. They want to be uh, in the top of the the game because they are the ones they are there. You know, you cannot rest or sleep because the other one can pass you. 
Of course we fight with everyone. With uh, Neymar, with uh, Messi, with Lewandowski, with Higuain. You know, with the top of the, the best players in the world. So, I mean, this is not fighting, but it's, it's, it's hard, it's healthy. You know, cooperation is healthy and we fight, you know, to be the best. This is why it's my, my main point, it's my motivation, it's to be better than them. The secrets don't exist. Exist, hard work, dedication, be obsessed to be something, something in a life mm. and follow their dreams. I think if you want to be a football player or if you want to be an engineer or whatever you want to be, dedicate yourself. You know, work hard, you know, and believe in you. I think this is the main words. Of course, we are in the control. As I said before, I have a fantastic team that they give me the information about everything. I'm not 100% uh, worry where the things going on because I trust in my people. So when you work with the best team in the world, uh, because I think I'm, uh, my team, the guys who work have the me. best team in the world. In my opinion, yes. yes. They work hard like me. Uh, outside the football, of course, some business is something that I like it, and I, in the future, I can see myself in that position. But now, as you know, I have to focus more in the football because is is my my job. Mm. But outside of football, I have a fantastic team, the guys in the specific areas that take care of me. You know, when something have your name, you sh I think you should have interesting to know how the things going going on. So. Mm. Uh, this is giving me motivation to to still work hard and better in my job. But I have to say, uh, to be in my shoes is not easy. Uh, but I'm not uh, I'm not complaining. I just I just want to say that I'm feel happy. Uh, all this happened because of reason. The reason is I'm unbelievable inside the pitch. This is why the people have so much interesting on me. If you're thinking too much about that, you lost your focus, which is, is the most important. You know, my focus is to be a good man and uh, to do it my, my job properly. So this is what I'm trying to do. I know many people depend on me, but this is, is all the side of me. I, I try to don't, to don't focus on that because it may, it's important. Uh, not just in the games. I'm in the training. I'm like that in the home with my sisters, with my mom, with uh, my nephews. I'm always. Uh, try to competitive hard and try to win. Uh, I'm like that. You know, I'm not. I'm not. I never change uh, because I like. I like this. I like what I do. I like my life. I'm a happy person. So competitive is part of, of my life. So in Madeira, in Madrid, in uh, England, I always want to win. I always competitive person. So best words is words is dedication and hard work to achieve this kind of things. You need to work hard and you know. Be a great professional, be serious in your job. And this is what I try to do. You know, to be here for eight time, I think is not by coincidence. It's it's because you know we all have talent, but talent without the work, it's nothing. So I'm I'm so pleased to be here one one more year and uh, you know um, to beat the records, not just in in my club, but as you say in the Champions League, in Real Madrid. And I keep doing that because I love to do that. I love to play football and I love to beat records too. So in my mind, I'm always the best. I don't care what the people are thinking, what they say. In my mind, not just this year, but always, I'm always the best. I'm always going to say that because we are, I think we have to thinking we are the best in our, our, our area. So in my area, I think I'm the best. We have money. We have everything, we have fame, and you say, I have millions and billions, but the most important thing is the family. Keep your family healthy, good, and take care of your family, because this is the most important thing in the world. Apart of that, of course, you have your life, your private life, you have your girlfriend, you have uh, your cars, your houses, your fame, but in the beginning, your family, it's always with you for the good moments and for the bad moments. And I remember when I when I go to to Lisbon with uh, 12 years old, that you imagine is not easy. It's very 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 difficult. Uh, it's one of maybe the worst time of my my life in terms of football. So this is why I grow very very quick. 
um, because you know the conditions that I have there without my father is completely different that if you live with your family and home so I grow very quick but it's part of the life I really really appreciate that because you know in this moment of my life I feel you know like mature I'm ready for everything so to be here in UMI8 for me it's a, it's a great honor of course all of these guys want to win too everyone want to win but only one uh, will we win so but I'm glad in terms of uh, individual I'm happy with my season I scored many goals I didn't win an important trophy but individual I feel very proud another another more here that I do it in a great level so dedication and hard work uh, this is my my words to dedicate myself 100% every time to be uh, the position that I am today um, is not one year, it's 10 years, 12 years, you know, to maintain my level. It's, it's, uh, it's make me feel proud, as you mentioned, Instagram, Twitter, uh, Facebook, Facebook, the number one. Of course, I feel proud for that, but for me, the most important, it's to maintain my level in the pitch, you know, to play good, uh, to score goals, to do assistance, to win trophies. And um, this is what I want to keep continuing to do it because it's what I love to do it is to play football and maintain my, my fans and my supporters happy. You have to dedicate yourself 100%. Uh, it, it doesn't mean how many hours you're training, but the way you're training, your, your dedication. You can have a training only one hour, but you give everything for that to achieve your goals. So this is what I try to do it in the, in the trainings, in the games, uh, try to be better and better in my job. And um, for the last uh, seven, eight years, I think I, I maintain my level in the same way. So this is make me feel proud and I, I will continue to work hard to, to maintain that level. A kid want to be a Cristiano Ronaldo, but anything it can be, you know, work hard. It's, I think it's, it's the main work and the dream uh, to believe in that everything is possible in a life. You're probably the most famous footballer in the world. What's that like? What's it like being a footballing superstar? It's great. Uh, this has given me motivation to, to still work hard and better in my job. But I have to say, uh, to be in my shoes is not easy. You have to work. I try to do it almost every day. This is why I'm in the top level many, many years. I think it's not. It's not by coincidence, it's uh, because I do it extra outside the field. When I'm 12 years old, most of the people told me, Christian, you are a very, very good talent player, but you are very skinny, very slim. And I put it in my mind, with the body we can improve. We can improve, we go to gym, dedication and hard work, we can improve. So I improve myself. Athleticism means a lot. For me, I think the small details uh, in the hands are going to make a huge difference to compare with the, with the other players. So I think it's very important to do this kind of work. And I think it's going well on me. This is why I'm in good shape almost all the year. And I want to carry on like that because it's, it's helped me a lot. It's part of me. I'm not doing that kind of work because I have to because it's part of me. This is very important for me. I'm always a competitive uh, player. Uh, not just in the games, I'm in the training, I'm like that. In the home, with my sisters, with my mom, with uh, my nephews, I'm always uh, try to competitive hard and try to win. Uh, I'm like that. You know, I'm not, I'm not, I never change. Uh, because I like, I like this, I like what I do, I like my life, I'm a happy person. So competitive is part of, of my life. So in Madeira, in Madrid, in uh, England, I always want to win, I always competitive person. So it's part of me. Everyone in my family loves football. Well, I remember I always play in, uh, in the street. One day my father uh, came uh, and he said to me, why you don't come in for the club when I, when I work? I say yes, why not? And I start to play, you know, to have the same routine, 
and I start. I go to every day to training and I like it to be part of you know a team. And uh, I training every day and you know my father was there to help me. Well in the beginning I feel that I I was different than the other kids. Yes, I feel. But I didn't even thinking that one day I will be a professional and uh, playing for example in Manchester United or Real Madrid or even in sporting. I just play, you know, to enjoy, but I, I never think that hey, I have talents and I'm going to be professional. In the beginning, I didn't feel it. First thing and the most important thing for me is it's football, of course. Nothing above that. Well, of course, this kind of stuff I like it too. Uh, so, something that I that I was involved many many years uh, since I was 18. So it's something that I like it. But of course, my my, my first focus is of course football. But fashion is something that I like it too. The people really don't know you. Who is the people to judge something that they don't know? Of course, this is. It's something that I don't like, but I have to live with that. I cannot change. I cannot change my personality. I can, cannot change my character. I cannot change my education. You know, I respect the people, but of course I don't agree because the real people who know me, he knows who is Cristiano, you understand? So I cannot change the mind of the other people. Maybe sometimes in the pitch, I show something that the people don't, don't, want or don't like but this is my my kind of way to to thinking because I'm an ambition person I'm, I don't smile a lot in the pitch because I, I try to be focused but in this in one point I really understand some people because you know in a life we have always the people who judge us but I think sometimes this is not fair but you know we have to live with that. Why make the move from Manchester United to Real Madrid when you did? I think everything has a, a beginning and end in everything. So what I, I do, uh, what I did in Manchester is completely finished because I win almost everything there. So I always try for a new challenge. Uh, this is what I try to do, to move from Manchester from Madrid. It's not about the the contract uh, is about new challenge, my family too, close to my family, different weather, the language, everything. And most, the most important things, what I move is challenge. Because I'm, I really like to put myself in a pressure to see what I can, can, can do. Believe and um, follow his dreams, work hard, many, many, important people and people who I respect a lot, especially my, my dad and my mom, always give me, you should, you should respect, if you want respect, you should respect the other people. And this is what I always put in my mind. If you see my, my career at the last six, seven years, I, I'm always on kind of similar level. Why? As I said before, it's a long process. Is hard work uh, and for the future I will try to maintain the same. I'm gonna I'm gonna push myself until my body uh, gives me good answer. So this is why I'm enjoying the present and uh, I don't think a lot about the future because I know the future will be good too. But I just enjoy the moments. I feel good, my body is good, it's maybe the best moments of my career so far and I wanna continue. Record maximum? Nothing. Zero. Uh, I just try to do my best every season. To win the, the golden boot, it's, it's important for me. It's my, my second one. And uh, it's something that I look forward for that. Uh, I have opportunity now to, to say thank you to my teammates because they, they help me a lot. They give me great passes to score goals. But it's, you know, what I say a few interviews before, I will change the, the own uh, personal things for collective awards like Champions or La Liga, because this is the most important. But in terms of individual, I think I, 
I play very, very good this season and I'm really, really happy with the, what I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 